Hello friends, welcome you all in this session on use of OCLC classify to search DDC number. As we all know, it is almost impossible to search a book which does not have proper classification number or which has not been placed properly. Being library professionals, it is our responsibility to save the time of reader by managing our collection effectively. For the same, we are supposed to classify our collection by assigning proper Dewey Decimal Classification number to each document we have. Dewey Decimal Classification System that is DDC is the simplest and worldwide used library classification system. As we all know that there is 23rd edition of DDC is available in market as well as online. I am sure all libraries must have those fat size DDC books set available in their library for references. And many of us feel unexciting to search and prepare classification number for each newly added book in our library. So, here we are going to learn effective views of OCLC classify website. Then we are going to use this website to search DDC numbers online. As a library professionals, we are supposed to use this OCLC website to find out the classification numbers of our books. And gradually we will come to understand the limitations of OCLC class. First of all, we have to open this page. We have to search on Google OCLC Classify. We will get these links. We have to click on this link OCLC Classify and Experimental Classification Service. After clicking this link, you will get this interface. This is OCLC classifies website there are three options standard number title public author and subject headings we can search our required title by adding international standard book number or by adding the title here or by entering the author's name or we can search by using different subject heads. Uh, let us start from international standard book number. Uh, I have already searched one book here. This is that international standard book number which you can you can find on the back side of each book which is internationally published. This is what is the result. This was the international standard book number of a course in number theory and cryptography. You will find all details here. The classification numbers, the most frequent classification number, edition 23. This number has been taken from 23rd edition of DDC. Everything is mentioned here. Then let us search a different title by using title a computer and their applications to chemistry. I am having that title here computer and their applications to chemistry. And let us see. Yeah, this is the result of that book computers and their applications to chemistry. The same result we got here. Most frequently used number is also given here. This number is taken from 22nd edition of DDC. Number of times we do not find the exact titles on this OCLC classifier because number of books are written by local authors which are not internationally published. 
that time we have to use our sense common sense by using our common sense we can easily find out the ddc number for each title suppose i am having one title here fundamentals of digital electronics which is written by professor bp bookshade which is this book is uh, written by a local author let us search this title here fundamentals of digital electronics see we received almost 12 results we know that all these books are written by different authors but the title match with our title uh, fundamentals of digital electronics we can take this title for instance after clicking on this title this book is written by knox and another co-author you will get this ddc number here the most frequently used ddc number got it in this way we can search any books ddc number on this website either by using international standard book number or by using title or entering author's name if we do not know anything we can search those ddc number by using subject headings suppose uh, i am having another book on life skill life skill life skills let us see not have this title yeah they are having this title you will get so many subject headings on our required subject title and after clicking these titles you can select whatever the ddc number which we want which suits to our library and we can use the same See here is title and after searching this title we received this result uh, they have given most frequently used ddc number here uh, almost 75% more than 75% libraries have used 540.028 54 this number for their book but some libraries also use different numbers remember we are not supposed to use only most frequent number every time we have to select that ddc number which suits our library because we are supposed to keep all those titles together that's why use the common sense whenever you find out the ddc number or you take the ddc number from this website now you will also come to know that this is international website we will not get ddc numbers for local titles or regional books for example if i am having marathi titles suppose lalit and if i enter this title here i will not get any result i will get result but those may not match with the subject matter i am supposed to 
have. I got result here also. But we are not supposed to find out DDC numbers for local titles from this side. Anyway, I hope you must have understand how to find DDC numbers using this website. I wish best of luck to all of you. Take care.